What's up guys? Welcome back to another tutorial. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make mod charts. So basically, this is just kind of, you know, rotate the notes, move the notes, make the notes fade out, stuff like that. So, first before we get into the tutorial part, we're going, I'm going to show you a few examples of what mod charts can do. These three examples will be downloadable in the description, and the time on screen is where you can skip to if you just want to go to the tutorial itself. Also, timestamps for making notes angled, moving them, and fanging them out will be in the description. So going into our application, Now I've gotten the script supplied to Boppy Bow and Fresh. Now this one was a mod chart we made in about an hour on stream. So I'll just be quiet and let it play. There we go, that's a quick overview of everything we're going to do in the video. But, to show some other examples of what this could be used for, I have this script on Fresh, which, if it was actually for a mod, it would be on every song. If you can't tell what it's doing, it's basically checking what the camera is pointing at and making the correct receptors or well the notes of visible this can be a little hard for playing but it's a pretty cool effect now for this last one we're going to go into dad battle although it would work on any song we're going to go into events this one is a note fade event so as you can see here, value one, dad notes or boyfriend notes. One is dad, two is boyfriend, and you can add a 0.5 to the end of either of them to fade them back in. Then the transition time. So for example, let's do 2.5. No, let's just do two, because they aren't faded out yet. Let's say it takes two seconds. Now they fade it out. They're going to fade back in here. And it'll take two seconds. Now, for some reason, the dad one is a bit uh, glitchy. I can't really figure it out so far, but you'll see. Alright, and then to showcase different times, we'll make this one only take 0 0.5 seconds. Then make this one fade back in. So yeah, like I said, all of these downloads in the link below. Um, it actually seems to be working better than normal. I think one of the notes fades a bit differently from the others, and I can't figure out why. But yeah, now let me actually go into the code and show you guys how you can make your own mod charts instead of just copying my example mod charts. Alright guys, so here we are in the files. Now, if you're wondering where to put your mod chart file, you're just going to want to put it in the songs folder. So we'll just do it for dad battle. But you would want to go into mod slash data slash your songs name to add the mod chart to your custom song. So you're just going to want to call it script.lua. Alright, so here you have a blank thing. You're going to want to go to the um, the Lua script API page from the wiki in Psych Engine. Very useful page for Lua. This is how I learned all of this. Go into example scripts. Open this in a new tab. 
this gives just a bunch of things you can change. Like you can grab uh, all the functions and stuff. This is very interesting to uh, look through. But for this one, we're just going to go with function on song start. All right, bud. Let's just do something simple, like make the note move or something. So let's go in here. Look for the tweens and timers page. And you're going to want to copy this. Now I'm going to explain everything. The tag. Just call this note move one. The note, this is which notes actually used. Zero is dad's left. This is dad's down. Dad's up. Dad's right. Boyfriend's left. Boyfriend's down. Boyfriend's up. Boyfriend's right. So we're just going to make it so. Let's say boyfriend's left. Then how much you want to move on the X? Um, you can do minus for one of the directions and non-minus for the other. I do believe minus is right and non-minus is this. Uh, we can check now. Uh, let's just add a duration. I would recommend saying like 0 0.2. And the ease. You can... Go ahead and open this page at the top of here. See all of these different things that you can put in here. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of things. Although for me, I just like to use linear. Although you can use... Another one I found that works pretty well is cube in out. But any of them work. So now if we just go into dad battle. You should see at the start of the song. See? The note moves to the left. Now let's, let's move. Let's change some things. So that seems to go quite far away. We're just going to go with 10. We're going to move it. And 0 0.5 seconds. Now let's try restarting our song and see what happens this time. Alright, so what it seems to be doing is this is going to that place in the general board. So let's say 800. Where will this bring it? Yeah, mod charting takes a lot of trial and error. Now let's go ahead and do 600, so that's around the middle of the screen. Now let's do 700. Alright, and now... We can copy that down... To make... Make sure you change the tag to 2. And now, let's make the right arrow go out a bit to the right. Or that not. Uh, let's just do 1,100. That should make it go to the right a bit. All right, now let's move on to no, to tweening them in the Y direction. So let's go ahead and do 600 maybe. Make that apply to the down note. All right, that did not work. Um, I think maybe 200.
I'm not sure what I did there, but... Oh. Oh, because I didn't remain it. It's very, it's very important that you rename it. And now, let's do six and zero. There we go. Now they've all moved a bit. Now, let's say after boyfriend's first turn, we're going to want them to go back. Let's go back here and let's look. Let's just search up step. And search up on step hit. And then. Curse step equals equals to a certain value. Then. And then you're obviously going to want it to be this little statement. Uh, Visual Studio Code should put an end on it automatically. Oh, and I think it's just equals to zero. But, let's go into the chart editor. Let's go find that. Alright, let's say 192. So that's right after boyfriend's first turn. Then let's just... Do not move five and between that to let's go ahead. Let's make it so that it moves all of boyfriend's notes to the absolute middle of the screen. There you go, guys. You can see everything moves to the middle. So that's it for the moving note section. Let's go ahead and change its e angle. So let's just remove that. Because we don't want them to move like that. And then let's go ahead and do... No angle one. The note should be the first boyfriend note. So the left. The value. I do believe 50 to rotate it left. And duration. It should have happened a bit faster. And then let's go ahead and let's go ahead and copy that all. And then no angle three will be the start of minus fifty. All right, there we go, guys. Now the arrows rotate. Let's make them fade out a bit. Let's do note tween alpha. Tag should be note alpha one. All right, so for the value, I'm not actually sure how to make them just semi-transparent yet. Uh, I'll leave a pin in the comments if I ever figure it out, but for now, just do minus one because that's the best you can do. Literally anything just makes it fully transparent. Then the duration, 0 0.5. Then the ease, Cuban out. So I'll go ahead and do my outro while the mod chart plays because it's quite a long one. So there you go. You have your own mod chart. Well, you don't have one yet, but you now have the knowledge you need to make one. It, of course, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like. And subscribe. Remember that I have a few examples in the description if you're struggling. Um, yeah, bye guys. Join the mod chart.